Okay guys, so I was sent these two jewelets by tudakiosa.com and I know I mentioned in my previous video that my Kijiko jewelet had been broken and damaged so it was unusable so I had to get back a new one. So this is the new one and as you can see just this cuticle clean on it. And this one is the ceramic bit in white, it's a medium grit. And on their website, it also said cuticle cleaning job it. So I said, you know what? Why not give it a try? So if you're interested in seeing this beauty in action, you guys know that I loved this job it so much and I'm so happy to get it back. Go ahead and check the link in the description box below for that review. And here is the new one. Now I'm yet to use it. I'm going to use it for the first time today. But as you can see, the heads on it is different. Let me see if I can get the camera to focus. The original cuticle clean angel bit just has like a little tip for a head, which is just like right there. And this one is probably like quarter of an inch long. It does feel a bit rough compared to the original um, cuticle cleaning of it. But I would test it out on my nails and you will see how it feels. So let me just go ahead. I already removed my old design. Okay, guys? So let's just go ahead. So I'm just going to put this one back because y'all can check out the link to see the review on this one and I'm going to sanitize this one now I do notice it says TD USA or Tudak USA which is cool so that's something new so you want to be really careful with this I'm putting it into my jewelry and seeing as it feels so rough, I'm going to start with it on a really low speed. Alright, so before I do that, I'm just going to push back my cuticle and then I will go in with my cuticle cleaning ceramic jewelry. So I'm just going to spray with my alcohol to cleanse this nail. And while it's still wet, I'm just gently pushing back my cuticle. Even though I know that I'm going to use my cuticle for a little bit, I still like to go in with the flat end of my cuticle pusher and just scrape away whatever excess there is on there. On a really, really low speed, I'm going to go around my physical area. And I can definitely tell you it is a bit more rugged than the original physical clean and drill bit. And it's a bit sharper. So you do not want to put any pressure on this. I don't recommend this to somebody that is now starting up with their drill bit. I mean with the e-file because you can damage your nail with this one I know ceramic gel bits are supposed to reduce the amount of friction I'm not saying that it's going to burn you but this one is going to definitely dig into that nail with any pressure put on this drill bit so you do want to barely touch the surface of your natural nail just focus on that cuticle do not press or put any pressure because I'm telling you you are going to damage your nail bed
as you guys saw, I did have a piece of stubborn cuticle that did not want to remove it, and I just turned the files to the side and it just popped it right off. I did not put any pressure on it. It's very gentle, barely touching that dead cuticle. And with my other cuticle drill bit, I did like to go around where that new growth hits my natural nail to blend it in. So I am going to do just that. Again, continuing to be very careful. stubborn piece of thing right there is from acrylic and I would just take my nipper and remove it in a minute I'm finished I'm just going to spray with my alcohol so you can see how great that works or how not so great it works okay. I do however know that the regular cuticle clean and drill bit that I owned before you could have put pressure on it around the cuticle area and it would not have burned you or damaged the natural nail plate. This one, however, I will suggest a professional or somebody that's more experienced. If you're now starting off, as I said before, this would be your better bet, which is the original cuticle clean and drill bit for your cuticle area. This one is a bit difficult to work with. So definitely keep that in mind if you still want to go ahead and learn with it by all means that's your decision but i'm telling you it is a bit rougher and if you put any pressure on it you can definitely dig into your nail i hope you guys enjoyed my review if you did go ahead and thumbs it up all the links to these jewel bits will be in the description box below i want to say thank you to dark usa once again for trusting me to do another review for you guys i really do enjoy bringing new stuff um and reviewing it and sharing with you guys my honest opinion all right so as always i'd like you all to keep safe and i'll see you soon